Hi there, it's Tony Joe from Remax Commotion, and this is your monthly uh, month end real estate market report. It is now March the 1st, so we're here to talk about what happened in February of 2012. So I was mistaken. Three days ago, I reported that we would unlikely meet or exceed the February 2011 figures, and uh, I was wrong. Uh, we did end up with 497 sales, which beat last year's 488. That is really impressive when you consider the fact that there was basically 70 sales that confirmed or came in in the last three days. And that's a very strong showing. Uh, we have had 1,318 brand new listings versus 1,276 this time last year. So it's close. And again, that's another interesting thing to report because of the fact that for the past couple of weeks, we have not been having new inventory come in at the same level as we had last year. And finally, uh, we end the month off with a total inventory of 3,977 listings uh, versus 3,714. Uh, so the inventory that's staying in the market is staying there a little, a little longer. Uh, again, as you think about it, inventory is coming in at about the same pace now as it was last year, but sales are outstripping it just a little bit. So the general consensus is the market remains good. There are some people that I've heard that have said that it's dead or it's slow, and that may be true in some market areas and some properties that frankly are sitting around for a little while. As I've said many times before, properties have to be correctly priced in order to affect a sale in a reasonable amount of time. The other thing I want to talk about is this brand new BC uh, new home, new construction um, credit, this uh, uh, bonus that has been in the news. There has been a lot of confusion. So I did report about this just on Monday, which was three days ago, uh, and I have since received more information that is contrary to what the uh, provincial website says. In fact, I just heard from the Ministry of Finance just yesterday that it is, in fact, a $10,000 check that comes back to you. Uh, the key is, of course, the forms don't exist right now, and they probably aren't coming out until the fall. So in other words, you can proceed with your brand new sale, provided you fit all the qualifications, like you're a first-time buyer, uh, the income level, not to exceed $150,000 in the household, uh, and things like that. However, they will not issue the uh, tax, or sorry, they will not issue the cash until you uh, finalize your tax for the next year. Anyways, all very confusing. I need to give you more information as I learn more because, like I said, the goalposts seem to be changing almost every day in that respect. The bottom line is it exists. There is a $10,000 credit of some sort for new home buyers looking for new construction uh, and buying before April of 2013. Anyways, thanks for tuning in. Uh, we will see you next week.